Another Dallas County school district initiated a mask requirement for its students. The Richardson School District opened its schools today. Steve Pickett is live for us now outside White Rock Elementary with the story. Steve. Well, Ken, this school and this school district sits in Dallas County. Dallas County has, as you know, a mask order, and so too now does this school district. The first day at White Rock Elementary School wrapped up with parents picking up their young ones, a parent crossing guard watching over those young ones, and a quick review of the required rule today for those young ones. Yeah, we really support our, uh, the, the mask because it's very important for our kids' uh, uh, safety. My child wore a mask today, and um, he wore a mask all Mommy. last year as required, so we're just happy the kids are back in school in person. 60% of the Richardson School District sits within Dallas city limits, and like Dallas ISD, Richardson now requires face coverings for all children and adults within their 54 schools. School district leadership pointed to the current rise in Delta variant COVID infections and followed legal advisors' recommendation to require the 39,000 children of this district and their teachers to mask up. The district superintendent said every school was in compliance. We only had five students that um, did not want to wear a mask today out of our entire school district. Parents were great driving their kids off. We opened the schools up for them to walk their kids to school. It was a great first day of school. That first day, however, also brought confirmed COVID cases. No exact numbers provided. The district had already said 100 RISD children and adults combined were positive. Today's cases were found while most were wearing masks on this first day. And another change for Richardson ISD starting today, a virtual option for elementary school age children. That virtual school starts next week. Reporting live, Steve Pickett, CBS 11 News.